Hello everyone, this is another review from smarterthandumb.com and today I'm going to review Advanced Task Manager for Android. Uh, this is one of those useful apps that everybody should have and use. Uh, of course, there's a lot of alternative in the market. Uh, most of them are priced in the same price, around the same price. This one is a dollar and um, there's also a free version that comes with ads. Uh, I'm going to review the paid version today, which like I said, costs only, only a dollar US. So if I open it right here, it's going to start with the main screen of the app. Here what it does, it will show you all the apps are open, the free memories, and the number of processes. Um, like m uh, most other task killers, this app will have the option of excluding um, apps to kill. And, uh, you know, various little options to show the free memory. Every task manager will do that, which are the basic options. So let's say I, w I want to keep assistant and exclude this. I could just exclude it and task. Uh, if it's already in ex exclusion mode, you can uh, remove it from the list. And you can also uninstall on the go here. So um, I'm going to end this here. I don't really need it open all the time. So here is the main menu. The other tabs uh, go one by one. If you go to services, it's those uh, running processes that you don't want to close. Um, why do we have the option to see that? I don't know. Um, you can remove the tab if you want from the settings. Uh, I just left it there to show you guys. All apps will obviously just show you all the apps you have. Running, I guess. Uh, yeah, those are the running apps. And uninstall will list all the apps you have on your phone and we'll let you uninstall them. Uh, in my opinion, this is the best app to uninstall apps. I tried other apps, uh, I don't really remember their names, but they were slow and not that efficient. This one was what uh, makes it different from the others. You can uh, select multiple apps I wanted to uninstall. And as soon as you do uninstall, they're gonna go one by one and uninstall them really quick. I find it to be the best way to uninstall apps. I mean, this is a task manager, but uh, it can do so much more. Sorry for the sound. Okay, um, so, um, just a second. Sorry. So, if we go on with the review, we'll just go back to the main menu. If I press the menu button here, You'll have uh, your exclude list. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. The preferences. So we'll just go to preferences right here. We'll show various um, options. See, you can show system tab, show an install tab. You can just remove them or add some if you want. So this is uh, some more useful stats here. But if the real juice is right in the application tab where get all kinds of things that the other task managers don't really have. So if I go one by one, just a second. So show memory info. Uh, just, I guess to show show the details, it says that it could hang the application, so it chose not to uh, um, open it. And you got the OTA, auto end frequency. That's one thing that I use all the time. Uh, instead of just uh, closing apps uh, one by one or doing it manually, I haven't seen this in other task managers. Uh, I might be wrong, but uh, for now, this is the only one that had it. So you can choose to uh, auto kill at various uh, different times, and I'd leave it in an hour. I mean, it depends on your on how you want it to uh, end more frequently. I mean, it's really your choice. Uh, here you can exclude apps that are killed automatically. See, you see that I already have a list here. Okay. Every time it auto ends, you can uh, make it show a notification. I don't have it on. I try to keep my notifications in a very minimal. And you got your enable to shake to end all. You can also uh, modify the sensitivity of the shake to end it all. Myself, I don't really use it. Um, I mean. I don't know if I start running, whatnot. 
might just be using a lot of battery right here. So that is all for frequency uh, for the settings. Sorry. And let me just exit the app and go on the home screen. So like most uh, task managers, it comes with a widget to uh, you can just click on it to close all the open apps that are not on the exclude list. So if I just press it here, I don't know it's here. And the zero applications, I don't have anything else open but the apps on my exclude list. So this said, um, this is one of the apps that you should have on your phone. It'll make your battery life better, make your phone faster, um, let you uninstall apps really quickly. And like I said, either a dollar or the free version with the ads. I mean, come on, just get it. It's very worth it. So I give this app a 5 out of 5. Of course, the app, uh, the interface is a bit boring, but it's not something you're gonna browse through often. And I mean, it's just a task manager. So yeah, I uh, highly recommend this app. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them anywhere you can. And please visit my website at www.smarterthandumb.com. Thank you, and see you again.